The family of Tyler Helinski, the WSU quarterback who took his own life in January, is speaking out about his death, taking out a half page ad in the Seattle Times. Our Aaron Luna read the letter they wrote to their supporters today. The letter reads Our dearest Cougs and football families, from the bottom of our broken hearts, I am writing today to thank you all for your outpouring of love and support, words of kindness and encouragement, and most of all, the amazing amount of love that you've shown our son, Tyler. From the spring games to the fall scrimmages and camps and games every weekend, in class and around town, he was touched by all of you, and so are we. Please accept this note as a very small thank you on behalf of the entire Helinski family for every text, email, card, flower, prayer, poem, and dollars raised in support of keeping Tyler's memory alive. It is important to us that we tell you how much this means to us and will continue to help support us in the darkest days ahead. Let them never stop. The letter goes on to say, I wish I could tell you what happened. The reality is we simply don't know. He didn't quit. He didn't give up on you. For some reason, he had no choice but to leave us. Don't waste a second thinking he was weak. People leave for many reasons. We will spend a lifetime trying to understand this. Don't be mad or angry. He didn't do this to you or to us. He was not well in a way not one of us knew. He fought bravely, but ultimately, he lost alone. As we continue to work through this, if we find more information that will be helpful to anyone else, we will share that with you. We ask that you please don't forget him. Remember the best of him and forgive him for his mistakes. And if you do anything, send your love and best wishes to anyone that needs you to do that. Reconnect with someone who needs you or who you need or love. Remember to take care of each other. And again, that was Aaron. If you'd like to read the full letter, just go to our website, kxoi.com.